everyone. It's Tuesday, and on Tuesdays, I have a song. I don't have my ukulele today, but I do have a song I'd like to sing with you and teach you for the first time. It's a song that I wrote myself, and it's about snow. Ready? It goes like this. I see snow, bright and white and shining. I see snow, when the sun hits it, it's blinding. I smell snow, it's so crisp and new. I hear snow, it softens the step of my shoe. Let's sing it again. I can show you some hand motions that go with it. Ready? I see snow, bright and white and shining. I see snow, when the sun hits it, it's blinding. I smell snow, it's so crisp and new. I hear snow, it softens the step of my shoe. My cat made a special guest appearance during that part. Sorry about that. Uh, all right. I hope you liked my I See Snow song. And hopefully we can sing it later in collective if you like. The next thing I'd like to show you, we're going to look at some parts of another plant or another vegetal object. I have a tiny pumpkin. I wanted to show you some parts of a pumpkin. This is the stem. It's the stem. And these indents are called the ribs. The ribs of the pumpkin. And this outside part, the whole thing, is called the rind. Rind. So we have stem ribs, and rind. Can you find the stem of the pumpkin? Do you remember where it is? Can you find the ribs of the pumpkin? Can you find the rind of the pumpkin? Yeah, that whole outside part. Find and rind, that rhymed. So we have stem, rib, and rind. You learned some new names for the pumpkin, or perhaps you already knew that. And in that case, you learn them again. <laughs> so our word of the week is indigenous. And I wanted to talk about indigenous art. The in people who are indigenous to the Americas in both North America and South America made may, and make incredible art. They perfected some art forms, such as weaving, specifically basket weaving. Very cool to weave a basket out of plant matter. Have you ever done that? It is hard. It's a very tricky thing. They also, indigenous peoples make beautiful jewelry out of beads. Another artwork that indigenous peoples are famous for are their pottery. Oh my goodness, there is some beautiful indigenous pottery. Also making dolls, wood carvings, masks, and embroidery. Also, you may have heard of totem poles. That is another form of indigenous art. I'm gonna share with you some pictures of all of these indigenous art forms so you can look at them yourself. Have a great day.